Hello everyone. This is the fifth sequence on inheritance and lookup. We'll be covering messaging and lookup algorithms for meta classes. In Faro, everything is an object, and objects can receive messages. So classes are objects too. And since objects can receive messages, classes can receive messages. The messaging mechanism is exactly the same. Whenever the receiver is a class or other object. There is only one way to look up a method. This is the lookup algorithm we've seen several times in earlier sessions. Now let's look at the example of messaging a class. Understand the basic principle. Since classes are objects, and each object is linked to a class, that is, an instance of a class, a node is an instance of node class. Since node class is an object, node class is an instance of another class. It is called node class. So, a node is an instance of node class, and node class is an object that is an instance of node class class. If that's the way it is, you may wonder. Node class is a class. A class is an object, an instance of a class. Which class node class is an instance of? You will see that in the next sequence on meta classes. Here are a few examples. Here, the object, a workstation, is an instance of workstation class. Workstation is a subclass of node, a subclass of object. Here, you must pay attention to the arrows. The arrow with a blank tip indicates a subclass relationship. Node is a subclass of object. Workstation is a subclass of node. The arrow with a black point is sometimes represented as a simple two-line arrow too. It indicates instantiation. A workstation is an instance of workstation. Workstation is an instance of workstation class. Likewise, Object is an instance of object class. If I message the object a workstation, the lookup algorithm searches the a workstation class. Then it goes up through superclasses until it finds a matching method. The mechanism is exactly the same when I message the workstation class. For example, if I send the message new to workstation, the lookup algorithm searches workstation class for a method called new. If it finds it here, it executes it. If it does not find a match, it moves up to the superclass, and then up to the next superclass. And so on. This hierarchy continues. I'll leave you with this slide summing up messaging to standard objects and classes as standard objects. Here's what to remember. A class is an object like any other. Messages can be sent to objects and therefore to classes. The lookup mechanism is exactly the same in both cases. It starts searching in the class of the receiver and then searches each superclass in the inheritance chain until it finds a matching method. You'll learn more about metaclasses in Understanding Metaclasses.